Here are amazing glories on the Trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. They're all 7n plus 1 God number series, and we detail more glories of the Trinity uh, on Mass and other gems, but these are just introductory notes. Um, first of all, we're just saying, first, the, fa for the Father and the Son, both are amazing 7n plus 1 numbers. The Father, the root of the word Father, three glyph root, is right here. This is the noun, but the three glyph root is what you go to. Three glyph root of Father is 8, which is 7 plus 1. The three glyph root of Son is 57, which is 7 times 8 plus 1. See, these are both 7n plus 1 numbers, 7 times 8 plus 1. Um, and that is how closely related Father and Son are. The root of the word Father is 8 exactly, and the Son is 7 times 8 plus 1. That's how closely related they are. And now if you add the Spirit in there, 218, that is 7 times 31 plus 1. So here we go, Father, Son, Spirit. This is the root of the word Spirit. Not the noun, but the root. You go to the three glyph root, okay, for the truth. All of them are 7n plus 1 numbers. God is the plus 1 over all the others. That is the meaning of this 7n plus 1 series. Um, and I find it interesting. The more you look, the more you see in the glory of God. I find it very uh, brilliant that these three numbers here, the multiples of all these three, add perfectly to 40, bang on the nose, which is a very divine number in God's mind. Um, and furthermore, these three are one. This is just mathematical glory. You have to, God is insane genius, and he just blows everything out of the water. Father, Son, Spirit are one. Here's the word one. That adds perfectly to 296. 8 times 37. Jesus equals 8 at 8 is 8 times 37 tripled. The more you see of this, the more you recognize that this is an exceedingly glorious number for Jesus equals 8 at 8. Um... Oh my goodness, on and on and on it goes. Um, amazing. Um, what's amazing, yeah, is, I mean, these are other interesting con combos. Jesus saying, I and my Father are one. He spoke these roots in Hebrew. Well, that makes a 7n plus 1 number. 7 times 11 plus 1. And the fact that the Father and the Spirit are one. Father, Spirit are one. That makes a 7n plus 1 number also. And the fact that the Son and the Spirit are one, that makes a 7n plus 1 number also. So, fascinatingly, the fact that all the Trinity are one with each other, the Father and the Son are one with each other, that makes a 7n plus 1 number. The Father and the Spirit are one with each other, that makes a 7n plus 1 number. And the Son and the Spirit are one, and that makes a 7n plus 1 number. So, um, look at that. All of, all of that is 7n plus 1. The Father and the Son... One, the Father and the Spirit, one. The Son and the Spirit, one, all, seven and plus one. And that is the declaration that God is always the plus one over all the rest. So here you see, over and over, Jesus talks about the Father and the Son. Um, so if you just want to take that elementary step away of Father and Son, that Father equals eight exactly, seven plus one, and Son equals seven times eight plus one. <coughs> You can take those ones to start, and all the rest of it is uh, what I would say level two. Amen.